It was one of those days where I sketched in the middle of the night and this is the result. Uh, yeah, Pinterest is a great reference, that's for sure. And I really, really, really wanted to use this acrylic paint. It's not the most opaque, but it looks really good. It's all shiny and all. And here I copied my sketch onto watercolor paper because I want something, you know, strong to withhold the paint. I'm just painting it all in with gold. The gold needs a couple of layers, so while it's drying on one side, I'm trying to fix the other side. And then I go for the red hair. Of course, I test the color on another scrap paper and I just blotch it in a few layers at a time and um, with darker, darker tones. I just wanted to get a little bit of shading into her face as well and those ears they're way too dark but it works out I think it, it works out considering that the rest of the painting is gonna be black and here you see the real reflective part of the gold it looks really pretty I tried to recreate it in digital but no it's just not possible or I'm not good at it so I don't really don't like the digital version that I will show you at the end but the original Boy, I really, really like it. I wanted to have a few more orbs and I add those in the next day, hence the different lighting. I touch up the other orbs because, like I said, with different lighting, you see that there's still some white visible and then I just block out the rest of the black. I try to do as clean as a job as I can, but uh, those those brushes are not the best. <laughs> I try to work with a small one, but I end up using a bigger one to just get it done. leaving the edge white there because I want to cut it a bit differently. A4 is nice and all, but I don't like the composition being so left heavy. For the has to pop, I get out my thinnest liner. I'm actually using this for my journal, but well, I'm back into traditional art, I guess. So I will definitely use it quite often. And I'm fixing everything that needs to get fixed and to make everything possible to see. And sadly my camera died, so here you see me just fixing up a bit of the black spots and that's it. It still doesn't look good. I really don't like how the gold is not really showing. The, the, this, it's not doing it any justice and it's so annoying. Thanks for watching and see you at my next artsy adventure, I suppose. Mm -hmm.